Oh yeah, I, I sent you guys an invite. Oh, you did? Yeah, I'm... Oh, wait, you can watch through the game? Hang on, hang on. Oh, I think you're going to have to resend it, because you sent us an invite, and then the game went off. It says you're offline on my... Yeah, yeah, it shows it okay, offline to me, Yeah, so. that, that's that's the internet. Hang on. Uh, let me let me just restart. boop a doo doop doo Okay, so, uh, rustic, deaf, gray, bam. All right, hopefully you guys should get it. Yes. Yep, got it. And there we go. Babe, I love this little tablet you got me. I forgot how much it was so convenient to move. <laughs> Best husband. All right, now let's get started. <clears throat> you know, in regards to the Foo Fighters, um, like, okay, so, like, not too long ago, I was thinking about, not necessarily Foo Fighters, but Dave Grohl in general, like, when he played for, um, played for Nirvana. Nirvana. Yeah, and I started to remember, like, because, like, I started to think about, um, different kinds of things to talk about when it comes to quote unquote fame and everything like I think there's a, like a lot of people uh -oh. blur the difference between fame and attention and to a lesser extent I think that's like fame can come at a heavy price <laughs> and in it regards does. to that it's you. it's with the regard of um what's his name uh, Kurt Cobain who like cuz when you think about you know the lineup of what happened with uh like the whole successful lineup of Nirvana from Nevermind, the um, like because Nevermind became an unexpectedly big phenomenon, and the band never expected it. They were just doing music just for fun. But Kurt, like Def, I don't know if you can confirm this, but a part of this has to do with the fact that Kurt Cobain had such a hard time trying to cope with that fame and success. Like he didn't know how to handle it. It was just too overwhelming. Yeah, that actually was sadly the case. Cobain was never really happy with the fame he got. Yeah, to him, he yeah. flat out he flat out would say in interviews that fame never really made him happy. He still was addicted to drugs. He still had stomach pro he still had uh, stomach issues, um, which was something he was he was struggling with at the time, and it overall just didn't make him happy. I mean, I I, I do recall like there was a moment where. He was leaving a stage, uh, leaving the concert, and there was a kid who uh, asked for an autograph. And very briefly, he just stopped to sign the autograph. There was a recording of it somewhere. It's a really cute scene. So he does respect some fans, and I know that there was one moment where, when he was in the middle of performing on yeah, it, like oh, an acoustic yeah. guitar, I think you showed me this before. The dude, like, he just got up, went to some other guy. Like, they didn't show it. It just saw him walking towards the stage, but there were so many people on the way. But apparently, he went and kicked some guy in the face for being sexually harassful on the crowd. Yeah, he. Um, there was um, a girl being touched by a guy, and so Cobain literally was not having any form. of that shit. <laughs> yeah, he immediately threw his guitar on the ground, rushed to the front of the stage, separated the two, and then walked away after making sure that the woman was fine. And then he just just gets on the microphone and shouts. Copping a feel, eh, buddy? <laughs> wow, that was then, the fastest Uno round ever. <laughs> wow. I think Kurt Cobain spiritually helped you while we were having a conversation here. <laughs> I don't know. I, like, I, I literally didn't draw, like, any cards. I just speed ran that crap. <laughs> but also, like, because uh, there was also, like, a scene that happened. Like, he had a meltdown on one of the concerts, and it got so bad that he started throwing shit around. And he also went in front of a camera and spat right into it. Yeah. I Although don't know. some people... Sorry. No. I was going to say, some people tend to say that he was probably, like, very high when he did that scene. Oh, absolutely. When he did that performance. High but or I drunk, wouldn't... something like that. He... God damn, he was just... He, he was, was going mess. insane on stage. It, like, and here's the thing. The song that they're... I, I think if I remember... I think I know which one you're performing. You were... They were performing the song, um, Scentless Apprentice. And that song's normally, oh. like, maybe three minutes long that performance went on for nine minutes because he literally just walked around the stage messing shit around god damn bottom it was line, a very interesting bottom line, the guy you know. was not happy performing and in utero the band's last album 
was deliberately made to be super aggressive because he wanted to alienate his audience. All it did was just make Nirvana even more bigger. Ah, uh, I know that feeling. Big girl. It's kind of like if you've seen that episode of Hey Arnold. Uh, no, Hell Gibbetaki hated the idea of being like a role model or being like a fashion role model or something like that. Yes, it was the next Hit Girl or whatever it was. Yeah, and she or got called up because she hit. was being so mockish and everything, and the judges really liked that, and they called her in for it. It's like, I don't want anything to do with this shit. Just sign this contract. We can work things out with you. It's like, ugh. And then she purposely tried to um, get more aggressive Sabotage to it. alienate. Yeah, and then she tried to like try to get like lose her job because she hated it. But then she found out just being like a sweetheart, like princess, like yeah, and she ended it like that. Yeah, she was super, super nice, thoughtful, and caring. Boy, we're just gonna. There you go. Yeah. Just want to make sure I didn't forget about you, there, big guy. <laughs> oh shit! Oh. oh wait. You know what? Yeah. Oh, wow. Well, why'd I lose? I had the color. That's why, because you had the color. Oh, I thought it's only if I don't have the color. Yeah, let's try that again. (laughs) (laughs) Fuck! Fuck! (laughs) Oh, Oh, no. Death's got like 15 cards. Wow, okay, that's all. Oh, I got mercifully. Oh, well, never mind. There it goes. Oh, perfect. I was thinking about the Nirvana story because I wanted to make it clear that when it comes to, like... Because I know that there are those people who have this idea of wanting to be famous. Like, it was just ideas on what I wanted to think of. Like, should we ever do another podcast and such? Like, I could, like, share something like that. And it just, like, it got to me. And it's like, you know, a part of me just felt really, really bad for Kurt. Mm Mm-hmm. Oh, that was yeah. Because right. it makes you one. Because it makes it clear that the poor guy just didn't like fame, and you know, tragically, like whatever other issue he was dealing with led to him doing what he did. And there's sometimes where I will listen to Nirvana, and I'll just start wondering what would have happened if he didn't, you know, do what he ended up doing. It would have been in, it would have been interesting to know that he would have at least quietly retired from the music industry and just became a figure of miss of. I think he mm-hmm. mentioned at one point that he actually wanted to try bringing back the new wave era, which was I think back in the early '80s, like uh, what was it, like Duran Duran and the earlier times of Def Leppard. It was. It would have been interesting to see him do that, Kitty, and even if he. Oh, you were sorry. saying, Kitty. Oh, sorry. I didn't mean to talk over anybody. No, it's fine. Um. No, a lot of new wave is yep. uh, a mixture of synth pop, electro pop. <laughs> a new term that is founded in the synth wave and outrun community is pop wave. Get on there. Um, and there is also um, dark wave. There is also um, oh, fuck you, have, Riley. Um, yes. There's a lot. Just in synth wave in general, there's a lot of Damn. wave esque. New wave <laughs> is kind of like, if you will, the grandpa of it, but okay. not really. So. It, uh, New Wave kind of reminds me a bit, like, when I think of New Wave, I think of the band New Order. Well, a lot of New Wave is also tied in New Wave fashion. So if you go to eBay, you type in, like, New Wave, like, clothes. If you're looking for vintage stuff, I've bought some oh, nice. stuff off of there. You can find New Wave fashion, which is about, like, the big, oh. more looking, um, Def, I love you. You, man, you are just wanting to take this abuse today, aren't you? Ah, oh, damn it! Oh. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Fuck. Please get cut. <laughs> But I do agree, um, Kitty. Mm-hmm. What were we agreeing about? The the uh, new wave stuff. Oh yeah, no, I love new wave, synth wave, outrun. It's, uh, I pretty much love anything that is eighties period. Okay. Eighties <laughs> like music, but I never really got into the fashion. The oh, fashion was so little weird for my taste, but he the music like is it. very, very nostalgic. He he doesn't like it. <laughs> I, I, I like '80s ca- music. I just don't like the '80s fashion. Yeah, that's no, what we. <laughs> no, because like I actually own a lot of '80s vintage pieces, and I dress like I'm from 1985, oh, like every day. And he's like, "Why Respect. did you for you?" And I said, "Cause like I do like I always have bright why color makeup on. I have the lipstick, oh, and I'm yes. just like, oh my god, why am I with you? Why am I dating you?'" Every time I see her with her like excessive makeup on, she literally just picture Drew Carey with Mimi. No, fuck you. I don't look like fucking Mimi. Yes, yes, you I do. Am... You got those freaking neon, like, freaking 
turquoise <laughs> racing stripes going down your face where it looks Not like you laid in the road always. and a freaking paintbrush roll like over you. I with pinks and blues. Sometimes I do So did Mimi! Make, Make it stop! Make it stop! Mimi did the pinks and blues too, that's the only color she Not fucking wore. Not mostly turquoise! <laughs> Which is a fucking blue! <laughs> do I look like a bitch that will yes. wear a fucking blue? <laughs> Oh, you want to rock a moo moo, but you rock the Mimi makeup. Excuse me, I rock a jumpsuit, and you know it makes my look ass look good. I could just I imagine like that. now that when you're doing an exercise, she's a maniac, maniac. I actually have oh, a. I love Ooh. when she does that because I just watch her tits jiggle all day. <laughs> I'm not even I can't. Remember, we're still looking. Oh, yeah, you got me on that one. It's okay. He can Get talk about cucked. all of he wants about jiggling my titties because nobody really here has seen my titties jiggle. I have. Yes, dear. Oh. <laughs> no, you nope. love my boobs. It's a very prevalent thing. Thank you. Okay. Game. Oh, get cocked, Death. Wait a minute. There is an outfit that you do like that I have. Oh, wow. Wow. There is an outfit that you do like that I have. Yeah, there is. There's a couple you have I like. Hey, well, Golden, you're still in here, big guy. Yeah, Please. I still am. Uh oh. Damn it! <laughs> yeah, welcome oh, back. Oh no! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> yeah, you're back all right, big guy. I can tell. <laughs> it looks like everyone's packed. Uh, Riley's got the least. Let's try to get him more cards. <laughs> if you Turn think I don't have a plus five in this thing. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> damn. Come on, dude. I had 17 cards. You really didn't think I was going to... Now we're that even, out motherfucker. Rally. Now. Thank you. <laughs> oh, thanks again. Like, no, thank keep you. Keep going. This is great. Boop. Oh. Okay. Well, you're just cute. <sighs> Wait, what? Oh, wrong button, <laughs> damn it. Oh, shit. I hit the wrong button, that sucks. Oh! Oh, sure. Uh, yeah. Wait, what does this one do? Oh, that's what that does. Okay. Let's just go around the block. I feel like your color of orange is being turned against you. Now let's go around the block again. <laughs> You know what? Cardio is for everybody. Yeah. Cardio gives you abs, motherfucker. It does. Oh. Do I have another block? No, that I don't. Me, there we go. Are we going to the gym tomorrow? Yep. Yay! There we go. Oh. I can just imagine Kitty just being at the gym all day and she's got the happiest grin on her face. I do. And Rustic's on the floor dead. No, we, oh, no. Go, no, we no. go to the gym four or five times a week. I wish I no, had your enthusiasm. No, no, Kitty can vouch, freaking. I'm, I'm turning into a diesel. He's turning Ooh. into a fucking Hawaii Five-O. Yeah, I, 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 I got. Hasselhoff. Yeah, I'm literally turning into like David Hasselhoff. I, I can literally like, bench pets. 250 they're, pounds yeah, now. They're, they're great. Yeah, yeah no, I'm. No, uh, we. I'm getting cut. <laughs> we've turned. Uh, I think I'm more of a gym rat than him because I'm like, are we going? Are we going? And he's like, oh, I go anytime okay. you want to have work. Could have gone tonight if you wanted. Well, oh. no, because I wanted to come back here because I've been working since last Saturday. I wanted to play Uno. I just wanted to play Uno, to, I, I wanted to to play like, Uno flip. I wanted to relax. I was like, I'm tired. I wanted to relax. So, and then, yeah. Thank God I, I wasn't a part of feeding the floor. So, because I did that like two uh, times. Oh, before. damn it. I completely zoned out. Poor I can golden. tell. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to distract you with my life story. No, oh. no, 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 no. You're good. You're good. You're good. <gasps> Wait, is there a sale? <gasps> There's a sale! <laughs> <laughs> that oh, was sorry. adorable. There's, There's a, a cute little squeaker. There is a sale, and I have to look at it. I'm sorry. Squeaky. <laughs> I can be very squeaky if you really want. There's no shame in that. <laughs> you would compete very well with Ellie. Really? Oh my god, I didn't even thought I'd already put that connection together till now. My god, you are absolutely correct, Golden, and that is horrifying to witness. Oh, thank you. Thank you. you could burn up these oranges I have a stack of. Nom the orange. Son of a bitch. Oh, Riley. 
I want to sh I want to just hit you. Fuck you! You're a <laughs> you're a piece of shit. You're a piece of shit. You know, Dust was saying the same thing about me this whole round. <laughs> <laughs> it's the last like five, until I realized he's got a plus two and two other cards that are not happy for me. Oh, oh fuck shit. you! Shit. At least I changed the color. That should help. Ah, oh, it fully, it fully rustic had that. Damn it! Wait, hold on. Uh, I guess we have a common enemy. Oh, oh, oh it's it. not my turn. Crap. No! Oh, he was gonna win that regardless. Oh! Riley, please get cucked. <laughs> hey, at least it wasn't me who won for once. <laughs> I still say he should get cucked. I'm not disagreeing. Oh, all right, one more round. Let's go. Yeah, one, yeah, one more. Yeah, I'll round. do one more. Yo, Def's got to win at least one round this night. <laughs> That's if he can keep oh. up. Wow, that is straight trash. I got this round. This is, oh my god. I'm not even like joking. This is like, <laughs> this is garbage. What about now? Even worse. Oh. <laughs> Oh. No! I'm sorry! I wish I had a plus five to play on that. I do not. This is about as basic white bitch cars as I can get. There is nothing here. Wake call, caught you in the morning with another one in my, in my bed. Head. Oh, shit. I fucking hate Adam Levine. Motherfucker can't keep his shirt on. You know, it's actually funny because I have literally one of each color card. Oh, that works. Okay, I wasn't trying to play that card, but that works, I guess. Sure, let's go with that. Oh, gosh. Yeah, that works also. Perfect. Rock, keep rocking it. This is going to be a fast round at this rate. <laughs> <laughs> yes! Hey, the first Damn. time it ever worked out for you. That a boy. See, Golden gets a gold star for that. It only took him seven different attempts, but he finally got one. <laughs> Golden, <laughs> your turn. Oh, it's like when you come study for a like test and you just put C on every answer. Saying, you tried. <laughs> <laughs> you motherfucker! <laughs> uh, uh, unfortunately, for some reason, the chat. Ah, oh, damn it! Unfortunately, you only the, had two cards. And you the chat that, can't be seen right. on the screen for some reason. Oh, that's uh, not fair. <laughs> Oh, there was a yeah, you're right, Rustic. That's not fair at all. No! <laughs> Riley, I'm going to fucking strangle you. Can I watch? Yes. So what if we just give hugs instead of strangling? I'll just watch, eat, and eat popcorn on the side. Did you just believe that I have only three cards I had when I was a plus five? Nice oh, well. Hug. Oh, that's no fun. Actually, you know what? You know what would be worth eating popcorn to over someone's death? A, pop, a plus five? No. Mark David Chapman. Yes. Man, you guys are just making this easy for me. Thank you. Son of a I bitch. I have no idea who that person is. He shot, oh, no. John, he shot John Lennon, and he's still and he alive. Did, and he oh. did it literally, and he literally did it because he wanted fame. Ah. Just spread <laughs> your legs. He'll be famous. <laughs> Now, did anyone look to see what color card I had before that got flipped over? Oh! You don't have a plus one, you. Golden? Oh, cool, you do. Yeah. Whoa! Oh, well, well oh my play, god! Lucky. <laughs> it's a Jesus. lucky play. That was actually pretty good. I can't even argue that. That was impressive. Ah, damn uh, it. Don't worry, I got him. Uh oh. Why does my phone keep vibrating? It's me. Orgasm, then. No. Also, didn't Mark, like, oh. didn't Mark shoot John because of something of a previous album he didn't like or something? <laughs> no. Allegedly, the reason he shot John was because of the infamous, you know, the Beatles are popular than Jesus, even though that thing has always been taken out of context. Wasn't that already straightened out during the, like, times when the Beatles were a thing or something? That was around the time when the Beatles were becoming big in England. 
Yeah, that's something I mean, when they started to take off of their first album in America. So he's upset about some stupid bullshit from... Oh, and, oh, oh my god, this is so dumb. I, was it the White Album he was upset with? No, no, he wasn't upset about the White Album. The Essentially, one? from what I remember correctly, for, he got angry at John Lennon over the fact that John, mm. back in the 60s, had said the infamous quote line that the Beatles were bigger than Jesus. And he couldn't Ooh. get over himself. Yeah. Although, again, allegedly, the big reason why he shot John was literally because of fame. He wanted infamy. We had eight, Look, three eights in a row. Too, but I'm not going to shoot anybody for it. Exactly! You know, he it's... also took... He no, also I, I was very much... Sorry. It. I was going to say, he was also very obsessed with the character That's of Catcher in the Rye. Really? Yeah, he 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 related immensely to um, Holden Claw um, Holden, the main character. You know what? I'm not even gonna characters. challenge that because I saw you pick up those cards. I relate to a lot of characters, but I don't make that in my life. Dude, it's almost it's there's also like a similar situation where a dude tried to shoot Ronald Reagan to get the attention of Jodie Foster, and the most hilarious thing oh, wow. is that Jodie Foster is a lesbian. Oh, that's funny. Yeah, and the other funny thing too is that when Reagan got oh. shot, you know, and he recovered was recovering in the hospital, he made light of the situation, saying, "Oh well, guess my new suit's ruined." <laughs> that's kind of like, like uh, that's kind of tasteless, if you ask me. How is it? I mean, tasteless? he said it to himself. I mean, he said it towards himself. So, <clears throat> but no, like, yeah, of like uh, wishing death upon people is never appropriate, you know. But oh there have oh, to no. be some oh, exceptions no. sometimes. You know, like when no, when Osama bin Laden was being hunted down, it's like, yeah, no, he... he Yay! He deserved death. <laughs> oh, okay, shit! Like, can we all pay attention that, like, literally Goldeneye has the same amount of cards and Riley and Darth has the same amount of cards? Oh, yeah, Darth. Like, maybe change the color? Okay. Darth. Ha <laughs> ha! That was a good call. Oh, good thing I didn't have to draw because I like did not want to draw more cards. Unless, uh, oh, Jeff was going to win. <laughs> oh, he had man. a chance. Oh. Thought he was going to win that round. Ooh, that's going to work out nice. Son of a yeah. ah, damn it! No, no, leave it on purple. I got this, guys. I got All this. Right. As long as you leave it on purple, I know I got this. Oh no, I got a bad feeling. About that's not what I wanted, <laughs> but I'll accept it. Ah, damn it! Uh, oh, Def called it out. No, don't worry. Oh, I wait, got wait, wait, right. wait! Somebody else called it out. Oh. I know he has a purple, Fuck. but wait for it. Wait for it. Ah, ah. he doesn't Shh. have an orange, and neither do I. So I'm gonna have to pick up cards now. <laughs> you idiots! Uh, I don't care. It made him from picking. Oh god, this might have been a mistake. Oh, actually, you know what? Yeah, I'll keep that. But I know he doesn't have orange, so. Oh, Wait, I don't have orange, but, I have, yes, but I have another swipe around. <laughs> so thanks, Rustic. Damn. Welcome. Hey, someone else won. Besides, oh, did you win the last round? Yes. Yeah, it was the last round.